All that's left in the world, whether in Cuba, Venezuela, Bolivia, as well as in China, Japan, the United States, Europe, the Middle East, Africa, all of them cannot, despite their resistance, despite their refusal, stop this march of death. Because they, as well as all that's right in the world, already are counted among those in this last parade. Communists and progressives, Nazis, Nazis and reactionaries, Zionists and anarchists of every stripe. None are excluded, none can evade, can evade the march. This one's not coming with hammer and sickles or swastikas or flags of any land. This one's the march all wars surrender to. But when comes the unanimous cry? When will it really happen? If death is peace, when can I truly die? You will never know, and yet you do. Because, because, because you may already have. And this life is your way of paying homage. Your way, your way of paying homage. To the power that loves you enough to have ta taken your life away and left you with the taste of immortality on, on, on your lips. Nothing mystical. No Christ, Allah, Yahweh, or Buddha in the wings. Miss the wings. Even lying on your back, you're marching. You're marching. You're marching. This is not a cynical or pessimist or nihilist poem. Join death to your life and you will live as if there were no drum to march to. There is no march at all. No march at all. You're there. All will be well. For all.